Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake I bring word, sire. There are demands from the Banorn that you step down from the Regency. They are said to be gathering their forces, as are your allies. It appears it will be civil war after all, despite the Darkspawn. Pity. I also have an interesting report. There seem to be Grey Wardens who survived Ostagar. How, I don't know. But they will act against you. I have arranged for a... a solution. With your leave. The Antivan Crows send their regards. An assassin? Against Grey Wardens, we will need the very best. <laughs> and the most expensive. Just get it done. Concentrate, like we practiced. Now, fire! taking these apprentices to Redcliffe. The first enchanter says you need every able-bodied mage for the war. They're young, but capable enough, as you saw.
mages are waiting to start the ritual. The mages wait to perform the ritual. I told you the only I thing I can think of that might help. Until you make a decision, I think I should remain. I think... No. Damn you! do that for you. Allow me. I could do that for you. I shall.
you won't like you being here. She'll just try to hurt you. The scary lady who speaks to me in my dreams. She's quiet now. She's never very far. Oh, the poor lad. I tried to stop her, but I can't. She said she'd help father. I didn't think she'd hurt everyone. Honestly, I didn't. She said that was why you were here. I want to help father too. She knew I did. That's why she came to me. But somebody has to stop her from hurting anyone else. I don't know how much longer she'll be gone for, but she's always watching. She won't let you near father. She'll just come back again, and then... Just tell everyone to stay away, especially mother. I don't want her to see me like this. All right, please hurry. All right. No, she's the one who does that, not me. After, after mother put Jowen in the dungeon, I snuck into his room. I found his books, the ones he wouldn't let me read. I wanted to help father. I shouldn't have tried, I guess. But mother was so sad, and I wanted to make her happy. Then the bad lady started talking to me, in my sleep. And when I would wake up, I'd have done things I didn't remember. It's all my fault. Because they would take him away. She says as long as father's here, people will keep coming for him. People like you, I guess. She wants to hurt you. She likes to hurt people, and it, it scares me. The scary lady went away, and everyone was fighting. So I ran to my room. Then she made me come here. She wants to be near father. You should go. She'll come back soon. Will father be all right? Mother said they'd send help eventually. I hope it's soon. To perform the ritual. I told you the only thing I, I can think of that might help. Time it has taken to a so you make a decision. The pages are waiting to start the ritual.
please. Have mercy on him. He's just a boy. He doesn't deserve this. There must be another option. The Circle must know some spell, or we could bring him to the Cathedral in Benelim. They, they could exorcise him. An exorcism will not help him, my lady. Make her help me! There must be some other way! Don't kill my baby! I'm begging you! Thank you. Thank you. You won't regret this. Connor? Connor, can you hear me? It's mother. M mother. I... It hurts so bad. Oh, it hurts. It's all right, darling. He'll find a way to stop the demon. Can you stand up? Fool woman! If I crushed father's throat, would you watch? Would you cry? You are pathetic. No, don't. Don't talk like that. Connor, come back. Please, don't go. I'm sorry I called her mother. It hurts. Make it stop. I... I will, baby. I will. I'll... Make the pain stop. Please. Leave me alone with him. You were right. He can't be helped. You... You are a stranger. This is not your responsibility. I am his mother. I brought Connor into this world. Let me do what must be done. I beg you. family, do you think? Enough. I wish to mourn my son now. Give me that at least. dead, and the demon gone with him. With its creatures vanquished, the castle is back under our control. I thought I'd never see my brother again. My son, your nephew, is dead. Do not forget that in your great relief, Tigan. How could I, my lady? 
Eamon has much to mourn if he recuperates. There is still the matter of Jowan. His poisoning Eamon began this whole mess, yet he lives. I must decide what becomes of him. We will hold him for Eamon to decide his fate. If he doesn't recover, Jowan's fate is sealed. What do you think? What do you mean? He is responsible for many of the problems here and is a Malefica as well. Perhaps you are correct. But that is Eamon's decision, not mine. I'm sorry. Jowan stays in the dungeon for now. But our task is not done yet. Whatever the demon did to my brother, it seems to have spared his life, but he remains comatose. We cannot wake him. The urn. The urn of sacred ashes will save Eamon. Thank you. I am grateful for your eagerness to help restore my husband. Find the brother Genitivi, the scholar, in Denerham. He has been researching the urn's location for several years now. The knights that returned say they were unable to find Genitivi. But perhaps the Maker will lead you to him. I must go to the hall and begin rebuilding. I wish you luck, and may the Maker go with you. Begun. I have more news. Um, yes. Well, it seems that the fighting has gone Enough. exactly as you... I would like to know what you intend to accomplish, Father. Should we not be fighting the Darkspawn instead of each other? The nobility should be brought into line and then the Darkspawn defeated. This is no true blight, Honora. Only Kalen's vanity demanded it be so. Beg pardon, sir. But Blight, or no, we may not have the manpower to face the Darkspawn soon. Kalen approached your legions for support, did he not? Never! Marek and I drove those bastards out! Not roll out the welcome for the now! We need help, Father. We cannot deal with this crisis alone. Ferelden will stand on its own! I will lead it through this, Anora. You must have faith in me. Did you kill Kalen? Kalen's death was his own doing.
my Valena returned. She told me of your daring rescue. I can't begin to tell you how grateful I am. Take this. A reward for your deed. It's dwarven made and should serve you well. Thank you. You're welcome here, friend. Look, you're... Oh, thank the Maker. We need help. They attacked the wagon. Please help us. Follow me. I'll take you to them.
Enemies approaching. See, you haven't killed me yet. Ah, so I am to be interrogated. Let me save you some time. My name is Zevran. Zev to my friends. I am a member of the Antivan Crows, brought here for the sole purpose of slaying any surviving Grey Wardens, which I have failed at, sadly. A rather taciturn fellow in the capital. Logan, I think his name was. Yes, that's it. I wasn't paid anything. The crows, however, were paid quite handsomely, or so I understand. Which does make me about as poor as a chantry mouse, come to think of it. Being an Antivan crow isn't for the ambitious, to be perfectly honest. <laughs> Why not? I wasn't paid for silence. Not that I offered it for sale, precisely. Loyalty is an interesting concept. If you wish, and you're done interrogating me, we can discuss it further. Well, here's the thing. I failed to kill you, so my life is forfeit. That's how it works. If you don't kill me, the crows will. Thing is, I like living. And you obviously are the sort to give the crows pause, so let me serve you instead. I happen to be a very loyal person, up until the point where someone expects me to die for failing. That's not a fault, really, is it? I mean, unless you're the sort who would do the same thing, in which case I don't come very well recommended, I suppose. What? You're taking the assassin with us now? Does that really seem like a good idea? We could apparently use a swift kick in the head, too, but you don't see me going around asking for one. Welcome, Zevran. Having an Antivan crow join us sounds like a fine plan. Oh, you are another companion to be, then? I wasn't aware such loveliness existed amongst adventurers, surely. Or maybe not. I hereby pledge my oath of loyalty to you until such a time as you choose to release me from it. I am your man, without reservation. This I swear. Oh, blast it. Yes.
Treason. You dare smear Terran Logain's word. The savior of Ferelden, Terran Logain, personally told me of the Warden's betrayal. Your betrayal. An uncommon traitor deserves no common death. We will meet on the field of honor, and my blade shall see justice done. Meet me in the back alley behind the Nod Noble Tavern. There we will duel. had me there, but I recognize you too clearly. I will not be played the fool. An uncommon trait. Meet me in the back alley behind the Nod Noble t Make peace. Are you ready? I am no savage. I would not take advantage of you. May the Divine look after you, sir. You've held yourself with honor. Begin. do it. 
No one is to enter the alienage. There's been an elven uprising. Knifeers even have the gall to attack the Arl's only son. Killed him in cold blood. With the whole Urian family dead, the regent appointed Rendon Howe of Amaranthine, the new Arl of Denerim. First thing he did was lead a purge of the alienage. It's a mess in there. When things are put back in order, the gates will be reopened. Now on your way. who would be very excited to meet you. I'm sorry. Sanveil prefers women with experience and maturity. He says they have more substance, are more robust and flavorful. Does he know? Indeed. No need to deny it. Zevran... He's a fine bird when he sees one. I am not a bird. Warden. No luck yet, eh? Keep trying. Right you are. You here to report another crime? I swear we should just cordon off the entire district. Ah, uh, can I help you, Warden? <laughs> what? You're serious? I mean, yes, yes, I could use help. I've got a pretty popular, uh, establishment that's crawling with mercy. If I send my boys in, someone might get, maker forbid, hurt. The name of the whorehouse is the Pearl. Beat down any mercenaries that are out I- Sorry. Used to giving orders. Thank you, Warden. Happy hunting.
shall be done. Dwarven crafts. Find dwarven crafts. In the name of Andraste, Bride of the Maker, be welcome in this house. While the cathedral is closed, if you need to make wedding or funeral arrangements, you'll have to talk to Sister Oma. Did someone die? I remember a funeral. King Kaelin died, remember? Along with most of the army at Ostagar? The Maker guide them all. That which you fear, living in the shadow of death alone. The death toll at Ostagar was staggering. We've had a funeral every day for a lost son or daughter of Denerim, and we've many more yet to hold. Are they singing the chant now? He should have retired to Valroyo years ago, but he wanted to stay and serve the remain. He wouldn't be a Templar and He doesn't forget who he is. Even if he may the light. your attention elsewhere. My business does not concern you. Thank you and farewell. I shall do it. Crafts. Fine dwarven crafts. What are you doing here? Brother Genitivi? Why? He was on the trail of the urn of sacred ashes, yes. Whether he found it, the Maker only knows. I haven't seen Brother Genitivi in weeks. He said no word. It's so unlike him. I'm afraid something has happened. Genitivi's research into the urn may have led him into danger. Perhaps the urn has been lost for a reason. I pray for Genitivi's safety, but hope dwindles with each passing day. I, I tried to send help, but some knights came from Redcliffe looking for him not long ago. I sent them after Genitivi, and they too have disappeared. Now, don't ask me where they went. You'll go after them. And what if ill luck should befall you too? This search is a curse on all of us. Some things are, are not meant to be found. I know that now. So be it. 
All he said before he left was that he would be staying at an inn near Lake Kalinard, investigating something in that area. Good luck. May you find the answers you seek. <laughs>